and uh, in the, would that first instance be trying to come to agreement as to when and how documents and information could be given? Absolutely. It, you know, the public sees hearings but does not see that the, when the process works properly, there's a back and forth and a give and take between the two parties at both ends of Pennsylvania Avenue, as I said before. Would you yes, say two sides. weeks into the, the Congress, issuing subpoenas might be a bit premature for the investigation and cooperation between those branches of government? You know, certainly, Congressman, uh, Congress has the authority to issue subpoenas quickly if they wish, but I guess you get more uh, flies with honey than with vinegar uh, to, to be cute. And um, working with the other side collaboratively is always going to be a better approach. Vinegar seems to work better on social media, though, than the honey. Uh, I yield back. I think the gentlelady, I would just point out, we tried the honey. 100 letters we sent in the last Congress. We tried the honey. The last the honey, Congress. The You're the now the, honey, the chair. The honey didn't work. You're now That's in the majority. The you should have tried that first as the chair of this committee, not as the ranking member. We, uh, we, we tried, we you tried didn't do with that 100 and some letters. You didn't. Uh, the, the chair now recognizes the gentlelady from the state of Wyoming, Ms. Hageman. Thank you, Chairman Jordan. Uh, it is a privilege to serve on this select subcommittee and I look forward to the work we have ahead of us. After over